So then from, from there we go, usually go to one-on-ones. And, and the, what we really try to emphasize to our guys is in one-on-ones, especially outside receivers, what we want to run the most of are slants and fades because that's what we think we got to hang our hat on to be great. Press coverage, don't care. Go three steps, stick your foot in the ground, stay flat. Quarterback, put it on his upfield shoulder, and it should still be unstoppable. So this is a great rep at it here. One, two, three, stick your foot, stay flat. Put it on the upfield shoulder so he doesn't have to break stride and he can run away from it. Now we teach this quarterback quick game footwork for a right-handed quarterback. I'll try to be fast so I can get to some other stuff. But for a right-handed quarterback, we cheat his left foot forward a little bit, and we go left, right, ball in quick game. Left, right, ball. That's just quick game footwork. Anytime we're throwing quick game, that's just the timing we think we should throw it on. Left, right, ball. When we don't throw it on that, it usually leads to bad things. I mean, obviously, if we're hitting the first read, if you've got to move on, obviously, you're resetting your feet and stuff. But throwing slants, throwing a stick route, throwing stuff like that, the ball should come out, a speed out, a stick route, a slant, the ball should come out on left, right, ball. That's what we teach him in quick game. That's what I did as a player without knowing it. Then they taught it at Green Bay, and I loved it. And uh, so now I teach it. Here's a good look at it. One, two, three. You got to make him think you're running. Stick your foot, stay flat, put it on his front shoulder. Same thing. This time the kid tries to stay inside of him. Boom, it doesn't matter. One, two, three. Stick my foot. I wish he would have ran a little bit more. Stick your foot, stay flat. And this is why you put it on his front shoulder. If you put this on the front shoulder, it's over. This kid, this kid back here is out of the play. But because we put it on his back shoulder, it slows him down. And now that guy probably tackles him. The goal line, same thing. Three steps and stay flat down that goal line. Boom. Stay flat. Stick your foot. Stay flat. That's why we emphasize the stick so much to, to communicate with the quarterback. Hey, I'm breaking. And if you watch this quarterback over here, he does a really nice job. He's going to go left, right, ball. I would I hope. Left, right, ball. Throws it on time. Puts it on his front shoulder. Keeps it away from the defender. Boom. A good look at it. Other side. One, two, three, stick your foot, stay flat, upfield shoulder, not bad. Not so here we go in the game. Um, <coughs> you know, this is that same play that you just saw us do over and over and over. This guy's pressed and inside leverage, not great look for a slant. We've thrown a million slants in our life or throughout practice, right? So we think if we get great at slants, it doesn't matter how this guy plays, we're going to beat him. When we motion this back over like that, it moves this guy, so now we that quarterback should know, unless something crazy happens and this guy doesn't win or they drop this in out underneath it or something, that ball's probably going to that slant. Obviously, these guys, if not, we're gonna, we'll find somebody. But my first read, because it's three by one, is this slant. Bam, looks just like those one-on-one -on -one reps, looks just like pat and go, looks just like routes on air, stay flat, this is why you put it on his upfield shoulder. If he puts this on his back shoulder, it slows him down, and this kid gets tackled. Because he puts it on his upfield shoulder, we keep him on the run, touchdown. We throw slants to score. If we're great at slants and fades, we're going to be successful. <clears throat> this is, let me look at the last one real quick. This quarterback's footwork, I bet, is good because this kid's a good player. Left, right, ball. Very good. He never picks up that back foot, puts it on the front shoulder. Nice.